game one of a day-night doubleheader between the Twins and the Marlins. Miami manager Mike Redman, a former twin between 2005 and 2009. Bottom one, it's Justin Morneau facing Jose Fernandez. Runners on the corners and one away. And shortstop Nick Green falling down, perhaps preventing the Marlins from turning two. A run scores, one nothing Twins. Top of the fourth, it is Joe Mahoney facing Kevin Correa with two on and two down. And Mahoney comes through just past the dive of Brian Dozier. It scores Greg Dobbs and Justin Ruggiano on the two-run single. And the Marlins go on top, two to one. Let's go bottom four. The Twins began the inning with two hits on two pitches. Here's Fernandez's third pitch of the inning to Oswaldo Arcia. A high fly to right field. It is deep. It is back. And Oswaldo Arcia with a three-run jolt. Three runs scoring on three pitches thrown here in the fourth. On his first major league home run. Well, he got a lot accomplished right there in that at-bat. Talk about efficiency. The Twins up 4-2. Let's go to the sixth. Then Correa settling in. Beginning the frame by getting Giancarlo Stanton on strikes. Then beginning the seventh by getting Joe Mahoney looking at strike three. Correa, seven innings of two-run ball with five Ks. We go to the eighth. Marlins threatening two on one down. It is Stanton now facing Jared Burton. And on a chilly day in Minnesota, Stanton gets plunked. Extra ouch on this one. Another look at it. Stanton would get checked out by the team trainers but would remain in the game. So Miami now has them loaded. Next batter is Greg Dobbs, the liner off Burton, deflecting to Pedro Florimone, who retires Dobbs, but Juan Pierre scores. That makes it 4-3. Now it is Ruggiano batting, two on and two down, and Ruggiano will ground this one to third. That is out number three. The Marlins settle for one, so it remains 4-3. to three. Let's go to the ninth. Glenn Perkins struck out the first two men he faced, and now he faces Nick Green. Another 2-2. Two, two. And Glenn Perkins has saved Minnesota's fifth win in a row. And the Twins now are a perfect 5 and in one-run games. The Twins stay hot on a chilly day as they take game one of the day-night doubleheader by a 4-3 final. Kevin Correa now 2-1. and one. He's pitched at least seven innings in each of his four starts this season. The Marlins have lost three straights and five of six.